everyone this is Katna here in this video we are going to solve this differential equation which is in m dx plus n dy equals to 0 form. So let's get started. Solve x square minus 2xy minus y square into dx minus x plus y whole square into dy equals to 0. Solution given differential equation. a square minus 2xy minus y square into dx minus x plus y whole square into dy equals to 0. Consider it as equation 1 or you can rewrite it as a x sorry a square minus 2xy minus y square into dx minus you can explain x plus y whole square right x square plus y square plus 2xy into dy equals to 0. Which is all m dx plus n dy equals to 0 form. Which is all m dx plus n dy equals to 0 form. Where? m equals to a square minus 2xy minus y square and n equals to minus of x square plus y square plus 2xy. If the partial derivative of m with respect to y is equal to partial derivative of n with respect to x, then we can say that the given differential equation is an exact equation. We have m equals to a square minus 2xy minus y square and n equals to minus of x square plus y square plus 2xy. Let's find the partial derivative of m with respect to y, which is equal to do by do y of m for m equals to a square minus 2xy minus y square. Since we are doing partial derivative with respect to y, so we'll treat x as constant. So here x, 2 and a square are constants. This equals to partial derivative of first term minus Partial derivative of second term minus partial derivative of third term is equals to partial derivative of a square with respect to y is 0 minus constant 2x into partial derivative of y with respect to y minus partial derivative of y square with respect to y is 2 y is equals to 2x into you can write this as dou y by dou y minus 2y. We know that the partial derivative of y with respect to y is 1. Right. So this is equals to minus 2x minus 2y. Okay. Now let's find the partial derivative of n with respect to x is equals to dou y dou x so for n equals to minus x square minus into plus minus y square minus into plus minus 2xy. So here we are doing partial derivative with respect to x. So y is treated as constant. Okay, y square 2 and y are constants here. This is equal to partial derivative of minus partial derivative of first term minus partial derivative of second term minus partial derivative of third term. Okay, this equals to minus partial derivative of x square with, x, with respect to x is 2x minus partial derivative of constant with respect to x is 0 minus 
2y constant into partial derivative of x with respect to x is equal to minus 2x minus 2y into you can write this as do x by do x this is 2 okay is equal to minus 2x minus 2y into partial derivative of x with respect to x is 1 is equal to minus 2x minus 2y therefore okay do m by do y equals to minus 2x minus 2y right which is equal to do n by do x therefore do m by do y equals to minus 2x minus 2y which is equals to do n by do x Therefore, partial derivative of m with respect to y is equal to partial derivative of n with respect to x. From this, we can say that the given differential equation is an exact equation. Okay. Now, we can find the general solution to the given exact differential equation. We know that the general solution... of exact equation is given by integral over x m into dx plus integral over terms of n free from x into dy equals to constant. Okay, let's consider the first integral, integral over x, m into dx. Here we'll be integrating m with respect to x, treating y as constant. Is equals to integral. For m equals to a square minus 2xy minus y square into dx. Here y, y square to a square are constants. So is equals to integral a square dx minus 2xy dx minus integral y square dx. Is equals to let's write the constants outside the integral. Okay a square into integral dx minus 2y into integral x dx minus y square into integral dx. Okay, this equals to a square into integral dx is x minus 2y into Integral x dx is x squared by 2 minus y square into integral dx is x. Here 2 gets cancelled is equals to a square x minus x square y minus x y square. So therefore, integral over x m into dx is equals to a square x minus x square y minus x y square. Now let's consider the second integral, integral of terms of n free from x into dy. 
So we need to choose such terms of n which are free from x. Right? We have n equals to minus x square minus y square minus 2xy. The terms which does not involve x is minus y square. Is equals to integral of minus y square into dy. Equals to minus integral y square dy. Which is equals to minus integral y square dy is y cube by 3. Okay. Therefore, the general solution of 1 is result obtained from the first integral a square x minus x square y minus x y square plus result obtained from the second integral is minus y cube by 3 equals to c. In this book in these terms, you are having x, y common, right? In both the terms. So, you can also rewrite it as minus, simply take minus x, y common from these two terms. Then you will get minus x, y times x plus 1. Minus x, y to x is minus x square y minus into plus minus x into y into y, y square minus y cube by 3 equals to c. That's the required general solution. Okay. A square x minus xy times x plus y minus y cube by 3 equals to c is the required general solution. So this is all for now. Hope you all understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then. Bye-bye.